Hi, I'm Matt Spaulding, and welcome to Go, Building DevOps Tools by Pact Publishing. I'm a DevOps engineer with over 10 years of experience in various technical roles, ranging from software engineer to release engineer to DevOps engineer. I'm focused primarily on programming languages, automation and security, and of course, DevOps tools, which is what this course is all about, and I hope you like it. In this course, what we're going to do is we're going to talk about how to build good command line tools for DevOps purposes and interacting with REST APIs, which is a typical day-to-day -day task for a DevOps engineer. In this course, what we're going to do is we're going to learn everything that you need to know to build good command line tools, starting with REST APIs. We're going to talk about first, what are they, why do we use them, and what are some of the alternatives to using REST APIs. Then we're going to talk about the HTTP standard library that's included with the Go programming language, and we're going to learn how to interact with REST APIs using that standard library. In building NAP, we're going to build on top of the standard library, and we're going to build our own library for interacting with REST APIs. Then, in Overview of Pork, we're going to talk about the architectural overview of the project that we're going to write throughout the remainder of the course called Pork, which is our GitHub project forking tool. Then, in Designing the CLI, we're going to focus on the command line interface for Pork, and we're going to talk about how to design a command line interface that is effective and a joy for your users to use. In Writing the Library, we're going to build the core library that powers the Pork tool. In this course, I expect that you have an intermediate level of experience with the Go programming language. If you haven't gone through an introductory course yet, I recommend that you do that first before continuing with this course so that you can get the most out of it. As far as system requirements, you should have a Mac or Linux computer, those are preferred. You should have the Go compiler installed on your computer. You should have a text editor or IDE, and you should have Git for source control. In this course, there are four goals that we wish to accomplish. First, understand how to use Go to interact with REST APIs. This is definitely something that a DevOps engineer does almost every single day, is interacting with REST APIs, because most of the services that are used for web applications have REST APIs exposed that DevOps engineers can use to automate different processes. Then we're going to have the goal of learning how to design a good command line interface. We want to have command line interfaces that are effective, that allow your users to get the most out of them possible, and that are a joy to use for your users. And we want to learn how to build reusable libraries. We want to effectively build reusable modular libraries that we can use in multiple tools that we build. And finally, we want to build a full scale command line tool for GitHub that will show us everything that we've learned and put it all together. 